Alright guys, welcome back. I uh, uh, am in a bit of a pickle, but we'll get we'll get it fixed. You guys are doing well. I uh, I was playing only for a few minutes. Uh, just hadn't hit the record button. Uh, I was I was still close shopping. I was there was one shop I didn't think I had made it to, so I went to it, and lo and behold, here we are. Okay. Um, no, I'm going to go do this one here and that's gonna put us right next to the apartment building which uh, I plan on using uh, there's a makeover thing that I haven't done yet that I want to give a try um, and I'm not sure if it's only uh, my first apartment or if it's all of them we'll find out Maybe the first apartment will become my favorite one once we're done. I try not to edit the rides in the city unless like, uh, it's super long, but I don't know about you guys. I find the rides to be very soothing. Uh, I think the, it best showcase what this game did really well. What you looking for? Hardcore BD? Maybe something softer? You don't got any real girls? We employ dancers here. No joy girls, no dolls. I heard this was a fun club. I could offer you a booth with a private dance. Or a hard BD. Not so fast, little lady. Yeah. No weapons allowed. We're running a civilized operation. Okay, I don't need my weapons. Where do I put them? Back up. Welcome. Please go right ahead. Uh, deposit your weapons where? Oh. <laughs> Don't I feel really naked? See, wasn't so hard. Welcome to empathy. Uh, well, thank you. Um... Don't let those pricks twist your arm. Hi, hey, ladies. One day, huh? Bathrooms? I find it funny they do this trope so much where the girl is like, I'm hoping drunk and not drugged. And the guy's like trying to coax her along, like, baby, baby, we gotta go home. We'll catch an Uber, babes. Please don't puke in the in in here. It'll be messy. Hi guys. Don't whip out anything that I can't show on YouTube, okay? Yourself. 
Head of security, my ass. Oh, honey. I told you that boy was old, no good. I told you that boy was pure scum. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I'll stop with the commentary. Uh, sure, I'll take the tomato juice. Hi, uh, that Sunday looks really good. You should, guys, you should totally eat that. Especially that guy in the corner there. Oh, here's another one. But I loved him. Alright, dude. Don't let anyone rain on your parade. Standing right next to it, didn't even phase him. Oh, he's with the animals? Interesting, I wouldn't have taken that. Thanks, Adam, thanks for your help. Scrolls are a prim, especially the kid with the tattoo. Is he still alive? If he is, we'd like to use him for another virtue. Whatever you need, uh, whatever we need to give him to power through, we can get it. Stars always come first, best. Eddie's, uh, Adam, baby, this is the last time I'm gonna write to you. Eddie's or your ass gets a beating so hard, you won't be able to sit for a month. From now on, I'll be using nonverbal communication. Three days. Available BDs.
calm down. Wow, the AI is kind of broken, isn't it? I just gotta leave without my weapons, yo. <laughs> That's what I'm fucking talking about. Get in, install what you need, get out like it ain't no thing. Gig is closed. You're welcome. Okay, let's head to the house real quick. drop point. Alright, check the nearest drop point. Thank you, dude. So guys, uh, the very first apartment we can do a makeover It has uh, new styles that you can do for makeover And it made me back to being my favorite apartment again Let's see Oh, Bebe, he is so cute. Alright. Net, yeah, easy estates. Makeovers. Uh, oh, we have quite a few options. Snow, uh, soap red tiger, neon sands, California max. Uh, lunar tranquility. Let's try this one. But 
Is it Did it change much? Oh, we got a nicer Oh, she's foggy out. Have so many athletic shorts. <laughs> Who did I rob? I'm gonna guess something really bad happened. I shouldn't have this many, right? I'm gonna guess there was some, uh, dupes. if I like it more or not.
One sec, I just realized they're matching. Let's see how V looks as a girl. <laughs> I mean, I should say, uh, as a dressed up girl. Actually, I'm not gonna lie, she doesn't look half bad, does she? I wish that top came in red, or purple or pink. Oh yeah, we got it. Oh, bye buzz. to pick up our uh, reward. I'll do that in a minute. So now my question is, if we bought it once and I switched, can I buy it again? Uh, let's see. Makeovers. is peacefully sleeping. little signs. Shower this way, toilet this way. Because there's so much distance between the two. And why do we have just paper sitting here? Are we? We're not using this paper to wipe, are we? Oh, there's a litter box. Oh, maybe we're using the paper as a litter box. Okay, I can, I can go with that. So make myself broke doing this uh makeovers so more do i have to pay this again i do have to pay it again mm, that's that's sucky all right we'll buy this one just because i want to know what it looks like and then we're gonna leave it What do you guys like most? The white or the blue? I'm torn between this one and the other one. This one makes it look really dark. Oh, but look! He's sleeping! Alright, enough of it. Oh wait, uh, I know what I was gonna do since we were here in the safety of our home. Okay, nothing there, nothing there. Oh. Uh, spring summer 2077 collection this upcoming spring don't forget to aim higher with the jinju cheese spring summer 2077 collection whether you vower, value essence over flare flare over essence or both in harmonious balance they will guide you on the path to find yourself graphite gem the immortal aesthetic of neo-militaristic shake uh, this graphic, uh, graphite black knee-length pencil dress with asymmetrical cuts brings out the steely edge of a born leader while simultaneously accenting the subtle elegance of your subdermal enhancements. It pairs effortlessly with the Arasaki JKE X2 Kenshi pistol. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip past this. Uh, <laughs> I don't think you guys need me to read it all. Alright. <clears throat> Literature story time. You haven't an idea. Uh, <laughs> you haven't an idea what you're talking about. The green-haired woman snorted and mockingly smiled. I've visited many worlds, each built on a lie. All, 
although this might be the first time I've seen its people so stubbornly close their eyes to it. Uh, Vasan felt a rage swell inside him. How dare this woman, an outsider to the utopia of Titana, so harshly criticize a system that has guaranteed the happiness of millions, he thought to himself. If anyone is blind here, it's you. Vasan fi finally erupted. Titania knows no inequality, no scarcity. For the first time in human history, everyone belongs to the privileged class. The woman smiled so softly with a mischievous twinkle in her amber eyes. Is that so? she asked. And your work at this cannery? Why are you unhappy there? Vasan forced himself to remain calm, and in truth he wasn't sure why the stranger's comments had made him so upset. Perhaps it wasn't the foreigner's fault she could not comprehend that humankind finally achieved the ideal society. Her home, as she described it, resembled a primitive world, one long tainted by the stain of feudalism. In a sense, she was like a child. Intelligent, yes, but ignorant and self-righteous to a fault. There must be a group within society responsible for this type of work, Fasan explained. Thankfully, due to the advancement of robotics, the means of production have become fully automized, automatized, automatized, and shifted away from our hands. We now serve only in supervisory roles. So to answer your question, no, I'm not unhappy. The robots do my work for me. Wait, you do know what robots are, right? Of course I do. We have something similar, only made from clay and stone. The lime... A haired woman replied, still with a smug tone in her voice. Very well, your world has done away with the work done by hand. But if that is the case, does that not mean workers such as yourself have lost their former value? Are you suggesting there are none who can govern your progress from above your standing who determine your responsibilities? No response. The woman's golden eyes flashed as she laughed at uh, Vasan's confused, flustered silence. My apologies, the stranger's lips curled into an embarrassed smile. Maybe you are an equal member of this corpo corporation, but of what I've seen here, nothing about it matches what you have described. Notice to all team black field uh, has sustained a class A security breach and has been suspended effective immediately. Uh, actually, we already knew this. Night City, this is Jillian Jordan with an N54 news campaign update. Exit polls for the Night City mayoral race have finally been tallied. Incumbent Weldon Holt of the Devolutionist Party received 47.8% of the vote, despite allegations of his complicity in the murder of Lucius Ryan, former mayor of Night City. But in a close race, Federalist candidate Jefferson Perales still sees the election with 49.3% of the vote. In his concession speech, Mayor Holt offered his congratulations to the victor. Now we see whether Perales will be able to realize his ambitious campaign promises. After the break, one will the Corsairs and the All right. Break. Hey, 
did you hear about that psycho who kidnapped kids and kept them somewhere out of the Badlands? Christ, what a sicko. I wouldn't have been surprised if he was a raffin. Yeah, it, a real ugly affair that managed to help solve it uh, with the badge from NC. One of the kids was his nephew. Well, aren't you just full of surprises? I can imagine that must have been quite the ordeal. Tell me about it. Even now I get sick to my stomach when I think back to it. I never told you this, uh, oh fuck, I've never told this to anyone because I hate remembering it, but when I was little, my best friend was captured by Raffins. It was an accident. She would have ended up a complete goner of Cassidy, hadn't come to the rescue. Some really bad things were about to happen, but Cass pulled out his revolver and the dust settled within seconds. But that kid's un uncle? Who is he, anyway? Uh, River Ward, he's a, li a little like Cassidy, I suppose. Uh, minus the whole cowboy thing. Self-possessed, unshakable, and a man of principle. Maybe I don't know him all that well, but there's one thing I know for sure. I can come to him with anything, and he take it seriously. I don't know any officers, but I haven't exactly heard good things about the police in Night City. Good to know there are exceptions. You always seem to draw the good folks to your side, V. That's a rare thing. I am still very, very torn if I want to romance River or not. Uh, I feel in a way like I would betray uh, betray Judy but in another way she there's no consequences oh my god people oh. see how glitchy they got oh. seriously guys are you back to this again that's the one thing I can always count on It's free money, right? Free money is good. You need to call your son. You're you got a little head by your feet there. Yeah, I drank with him. Didn't know internal had their eye on him. I thought, yeah, I'll tell you everything, sure. Whole different conversation. Okay. Yeah. Where am I going to find that? Ah, okay. Yeah. Sure. Just walking all over your crime scene. We've already established that you don't care. I can't remember what sci-fi movie it was, uh, like Almost Human or, oh no, it was, um, oh, the one with Bruce Willis, uh, Fifth Element, where if they tapped someone in a car accident, uh, they uh, automatically got fined. <laughs> Good thing that's not me, huh? <laughs> I wouldn't ever have any money. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get this cyber psycho and then I gotta call it done because I'm gonna go make dinner. I'm gonna 
have, uh, I think some, I don't know what kind of fish, some kind of fish, and uh, red beans and rice. Sounds fancy, but it's not. Uh, hard work pays off, ain't that right? You're starting to become a known quantity, meaning I got some fresh gigs for you. down at a construction site downtown, my money on another cyber psycho. Scavs sometimes come here to sell their victims' implants. Maybe a deal didn't go smoothly and one of the scavs got a little carried away. God damn it! Hmm? Excuse me? Oh, he is, he is bleeding from his butt. And he has no head. So it wasn't you that screamed, God damn it. Sorry, dude. I didn't realize you were gonna go down so fast. Oh, I feel a little bad. I need those neural blockers, a lot of them now. Uh, so we'll get some. Fuck, I said I need them now. The pain's got me losing my damn mind. Chill. They'll get here when they get here. What's the pain from anyway? They poisoned me. Fucking biotechnical. Uh, 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 everyone's here got it. Their goddamn lungs are collapsing. Some are dead already, I swear, once I'm back on my feet. Alright, shit, was just trying to be polite. Never ask for your whole fucking life story. I'm really sorry I killed you. I didn't mean to. I thought you were gonna be tougher than that. get those blockers the client wanted uh no what client the annoying one. Oh, that one shit don't got him so now what how are you gonna make it up to a massage's balls first of all fuck you and second of all why are we the ones cleaning up biotechnica's mess good point so it's on the menu i say we carve him to the fucking bone just don't forget the tools because i'm not yoinking his implants with my bare hands meds or no meds uh gunk's fucked anyway plus not like he would have put in a good word for us he's still got bad lungs who the fuck cares? Instead, the meds he'll get steal to the gut. Life's a bitch, ain't it? Oh, come off it. You had a job and you botched it. Fucking own up and stop acting so smart. Uh, you get those blockers? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Oh. Apparently the game's kind of broken. <laughs> no, say it ain't so. This game broken? Never. I and don't mistake me, even though I'm mocking it for all of its bugs and glitches, uh, I still really quite enjoy it. Clearly, I mean, I'm playing it all the way. I can't promise a hundred percent, but uh, I am enjoying it. All right, let's uh, message Regina. Let her know I killed the guy. Regina. Turns out Cedric met the same sad fate as the other Red Orchard uh, members that Biotechnica was experimenting on. Scavs decided to kick him while he was down, and that's when he snapped, as would anyone. First the corpo corpos, then the scavs, and now you. Who knew you'd be at the end of that downward spiral? Hey. I didn't mean to kick him. Down. Much. Your 
memory. No, I just don't want to keep up. Uh, oh, she actually even gave me a picture of it. want a van, dude, at all. V, got a guy I need gone. Used to be iron for hire. Still acts like it. But the eddies are worth the risk, trust me. Need more intel, check the attachment. Waiting on your seat. Thanks. Sunsees. I know that my husband and I are no more than Bunraku dolls in the hands of puppeteers, but I hope you took my request to heart. For everyone's safety, this is the last time we'll be in contact. Good luck. Um, you have been blocked. Fair enough. Alright, how do I from back here? Says from here. That wasn't a button I meant to click at all. Nor a that. Alright, it is showing. Okay, what's this one?